welcome to Car Traction and today's video is a short history on the iconic British classic which is the Morris Minor. Now the Morris Minor was a British car that made its debut at the 1948 Earls Court Motor Show. Designed by Alec Isagonis, more than 1.6 million would be produced between 1948 and 1972. The car would become a true British classic one of the most recognisable old cars out to be seen on the road. The first production minor was the MM. It sported a pre-war design 918cc side valve four cylinder engine, although originally designed to accommodate a flat four. The engine would push the car to just 64 miles per hour while giving a reasonable 40 miles per gallon. In 1951, the old low light cars were replaced by the iconic raised headlight styling that would endure until 1972, where the final car was produced. The, the next variation was the Morris Minor Series 2. These were made from 1952 up until 1956. The, Morris previ the previous Morris drivetrain would be replaced by an Austin-designed 803cc overhead valve A-series engine. An estate version, known as the Traveller, was introduced in 1952, which had a wooden frame for the rear bodywork. Also in 1952, the iconic central speedometer was introduced. In October 54, the styling was updated with a horizontal slat grille. In 1956, the Morris received major updates such as a one-piece one, one windscreen instead of the old split screen. The dawn of the motorway era saw the fitting of a new 948cc variant of BMC's A-Series engine. Its name, the Morris Minor 1000, reflects on its engine size. In December 1960, the Minor became British, Britain's first car to sell over one million examples. In 1961, its semaphore indicators were replaced by more modern indicators on the car's body itself, and in 1962, it received a 1,098cc A-series four-cylinder engine that produced 48 brake horsepower. Over the years, the Minor has taken many forms as a two-door, four-door, pickup, estate and van. The vans and pickups have a, had a separate chassis. So, where do they rust? Rust on muggies is commonplace, primarily found in the sills, floors, rear wings, spring hangers and sometimes even in the boot floor. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe if you've not already done so. Is your car featured in this photo selection? Make sure to drop a comment in the section below. Thanks for watching!